South Salt Lake, the opposition to the proposed homeless shelter sites there growing more organized. Political specialist Lad Egan continues our team coverage. He's out live on Main Street where business owners are putting up a fight. Lad? Yeah, that's right, Dave. You know, they are handing out uh, stickers like this saying not on Main. They're also putting up some yard signs like this one behind me here saying to stand up for South Salt Lake. They're all hoping to sway the committee away from putting the shelter here on Main Street. It is time to fight for our city. With her city now having four potential shelter sites, South Salt Lake's mayor says the process is lacking transparency. We have no more public comment except for tonight. Mayor Cherie Wood criticizes the bill passed by lawmakers to fund the new shelter. HB 441 has created a mess. It's a recipe for disaster in our community. She met with about 80 business owners and residents at Crown Burger today as they picked up yard signs and got organized ahead of tonight's public meeting. And all they're going to do is dump people here. Where's everything that goes with it? Where is the, the money that's going to help us to be able to support something like that. I believe Salt Lake City had 18 months to come up with uh, their sites and they're giving us three weeks, you know, for public opinion. Area businesses say they are already dealing with problems from a chronic homeless shelter nearby. Well, we're already stretched and I feel that we've already done our share. You can't let your business fail because the people are afraid to come. This ballroom dance studio worries customers won't come to evening classes if the up to 300 bed shelter moves in down the street. It is a, a serious concern and ladies get worried, they get afraid, they don't want to go to their cars. Salt Lake County says it is taking the input from the public very seriously and that it's confident that the best site will be selected. Once it is selected, Dave, Salt Lake County Mayor Ben McAdams says that there will be resources, steps will be made to mitigate any negative impacts that the shelter might have on an area. Wow, this is such an emotional issue. Lad Egan in South Salt Lake. Thanks, Lad. KSL.